What's happening right now, an NFL player in Jacksonville native is back home to give back to his community through a free football camp. This is so cool. Marquise Haynes is holding the free camp today at his alma mater, University Christian School. And News for Jacks reporter Aaron Farrar is live there now. Good morning, Aaron. Good morning, and I'm here with Marquise right now. He is back for his second year doing this at his alma mater. So, Marquise, thanks for joining us this morning. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What is it like to be back home, giving back to where you uh, came from, your, your stomping grounds here? Well, it's just a blessing just to be able to grow up and grow up here and just give back to the community and stuff. I mean, it's just pretty awesome, knowing the fact that I, I really was, you know, I came from here, the school itself, and now look where I progressed now. So just giving back is something I always wanted to do. A lot of kids here, you see them sitting in the bleachers right now getting ready to start the camp. What are some of those drills you're going to be doing with them today? I know it's only a couple of hours of this camp. Uh, basically, we're going to do a couple of just running around, have fun type drills, you know, just uh, getting through the bags and cones and have, some, have a little competition when they come to races and stuff. So we're just going to come out here, have a blast, and, you know, make sure they just have a great smile. And you're not here alone. You have some other NFL players with you, correct? So who do you have with you helping out with the camp today? I have my teammate, Ito Gross Matos, and I also have my former teammate who played for for the Washington Commanders and Phil Bada. When you have these opportunities to talk with these kids who are honestly excited to be here, and some look up to you uh, as a role model, what does that mean to you, knowing that you are an inspiration to some kids? Uh, it means a lot. I mean, it just means, it means more. I just got to keep on going and don't, don't ever stop what I'm doing because when I'm being a role model, it means it's leading to them wanting to do the same thing and follow my footsteps so that we, we're going in the right steps. This is your second year of doing this camp. What's going to be different this year than the first time you did it last year? Uh, we're going to bring more energy. I know first year, you know, you get get a little butterfly because you're nervous about the turn on and stuff. But it's never about the turn on. It just, it's the outcome of what you get. And the, and the feedback we got from last year camp made more people want to come. So that, that's the positive that we're looking for. Lastly, you're about to start your sixth year with the Carolina Panthers. But, of course, it all started here for the most part. What was it about here, University Christian School, that pro that prepared you for an NFL career now a, a good a long one longevity one six years uh, I think it's, it's that work ethic I mean every time we came out here and practice and stuff Coach Pennon always told us like you're gonna you're gonna get beat but how you get back up is how you like respond is you take on the challenges and stuff so and that's what we did and like playing here at this school like we always we always became like an underdog because the other teams see us and stuff we, we may not have that many people but you bear the best belief, like, all 40 of us, we're going to come ready to the war. So, like, we always keep that underdog mentality, and that's what kept me – that really what kept me going all the way. I always kept that underdog mentality. Like, just keep going. Like, don't back down for no one. Awesome. Marquise, thank you uh, for joining us this morning. Thank you for what you do. Again, this camp, starting right now, going to last until noon today. Age is for those who are able to participate, 5 years old to 16 years old, here at University Christian School. Reporting live, I'm Aaron Ferrar, Channel 4, The Local Station.